Hey there, Jake from Drone Tech. Today we're going to be taking the DJI Osmo to California's oldest mission. Now the purpose of this video is to see how the Osmo reacts in extremely low light situations. Uh, in many of these shots, the ISO was maxed out at 3200. Now we did do some minor editing to the footage, we desaturated it a little bit and gave it a sepia look, but we did not do any noise reduction. So all of the noise that you see in the footage is original and uh, has not been reduced at all. Now we'll display an approximate ISO setting in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. The Osmo was set in shutter priority, so the ISO was variable throughout the footage. As you can see, there is a lot of grain in the higher ISO footage, but the Osmo does a great job at transitioning between the ISO settings. So we had this in shutter priority and the ISO was adjusting automatically. Now we've rounded off the ISO settings like here, 1600 ISO, but many times the ISO is something like 843 or 977. So our overall thoughts of the Osmo in a low light situation is that it, anything above 400 ISO produced such noisy footage that it was really unusable. So if you're planning on using this in low light situations for weddings or other indoor shots, I would wait and see what cameras are available in the upcoming months for the Osmo. If you found this video useful, please like it, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe.